Put it in the bag. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> Yeah. Dude, are you jetting right now? <laughs> oh my God. This video is brought to you by Squarespace, the all in one platform to help you build your brand or business online. But we'll get to that a little later. Welcome back to the break room. Woo. I'm here with Michelle, Woo. Austin, and Taylor. Yeah. Okay, so Avatar, the series, has been released finally, and we three have watched all of it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Or one of the only, well, we we spent the weekend basically just. Yes, we yeah. had to. Yeah, we had to for for the culture. Uh -huh. um, and we have thoughts. We want to talk about it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, Austin reacted to the trailer on Breaking. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now there's probably more thoughts that he has from that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, well, first off, I want to give context to our relationship to Avatar too. Mm -hmm. um, I'll go first because like. Just so you guys know, I came into Avatar late. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I watched all the animation. Like right before. When did you right finish? Before. Like January. Oh. But you had a, didn't you have a break where you watched a little bit and then you yeah. stopped? Yeah, yeah. And then there you was watched like, it? I think in COVID I started mm -hmm. in book oh. one and mm -hmm. then I stopped because I, um, I think I got caught up in other shows and stuff mm -hmm. like that. And it wasn't really catching. I didn't really get too deep mm -hmm. yeah. to where I was addicted. But then once I got to book two, like uh, yeah. end of last year, mm -hmm. it got I had to finish everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel like once you get to book two, you're like, oh, it gets it get or like end of book one, it's like, oh, it's pretty good, and yeah. then big, yeah. book two starts, you're like, oh, this is a lot better now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and then you like both watched a long time ago. No, so no, I I was co I watched during COVID. Okay, okay. Because okay. I had only watched it as an adult. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I watched it when I was younger, when it was like airing on Nickelodeon, and then because I I don't think I like was you know like dedicated like every whatever mm -hmm. you know it's like uh -huh. every tuesday at 8 p.m or something i wasn't like that and then so there's a period of time where i kind of stopped and then i remember me and my brother were talking about it and we found all the episodes on nickelodeon so we oh. just started watching it okay yeah so we, we watch it like like then uh i don't know maybe i was in like high school or, or oh, something okay, okay yeah yeah yeah, yeah. That's, that's um and then so rewatched it again during covid Got it. When it it's came probably on. a good rewatch. Mm -hmm. It holds up. It holds up. After, yeah. And after watching the live action, it makes you want to rewatch it a little <laughs> bit just to remember the magic, you know? Yeah. A little yeah. Bit. So let's go into some no, non spoiler uh, judgments. Thoughts. Okay. Non spoiler thought. If you had to rate this show with a noise, because <laughs> I think ratings and grades are kind of, you know, it could be a little subjective. Hmm. What what kind of noise would you make? You say this isn't subjective. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Taylor, go first. I'll be. I would give like a. Uh, uh, uh. That's okay. what I'd give uh -huh. it. Uh, uh. <laughs> it's the same sound. This is more like a. His more. Like, uh, and more. Like, uh. He's a little bit a little less. He's a, a little, little bit, bit less. less. Mm. Mm. That's mine. Mm. Mm. Okay, so a little bit less okay. even. Cause, so kind of a cause spectrum here then. My my take, well, I think um, it's definitely going to be, it was always going to be hard to live mm -hmm, up mm -hmm. to the original animation. And it was, so I think we agree, it's better than the movie. Yeah, I, I didn't watch, watch, the, movie, watch the movie, but I have okay. heard it's very it's so much better. It's better than the movie. And for me, I want there to be season two. I am mm. on board and willing to watch another season. So I would recommend people to watch it to allow that to happen. Mm. I, I, I see what you mean. I I, yes. I I would want there to be a season two because I feel like uh, as much as there's things where I wasn't a huge fan of, yeah. I think I, I want to give it at least one more season to see if they're able to take it somewhere that I'm actually interested in. Mm -hmm. And then from maybe after season two, I'll, I'll have a different opinion. But I'm like, oh, I think there's enough where their season two could be good. So I wouldn't want to take away from them just yet. So I, I would definitely want to see a season two. Mm -hmm. I think it would be fine if they had a season two. I think I just wouldn't be so dedicated to watch it. Uh, I would just be like, oh, I'll put it in the background while I clean my room or something. I see. Yeah. I think cool. I think if you go into the show understanding it's not 100% for the fans of mm -hmm. the cartoon and it's to get non-Avatar cartoon fans like on board like yeah. just to get them to want to watch it then i think you wouldn't if you get go into that mindset it's not like an upsetting series yeah i think yeah. like people new to the whole franchise yeah. could enjoy it yeah. yeah right i don't know do you agree with that statement i i 
I mean, Chris Chris hasn't watched it before, and he was saying he enjoyed yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. true. So that's a good he, he test. It's a little cheesy, but I think he's still a general, yeah. general positive. The sponsor of today's video is Squarespace. We love Squarespace and have been using their platform to build our brand and business online for years. We use one of their flexible website templates to create our own site. From there, we were able to customize and add features to fit our unique needs as a production company. One of those features is the ability to create video collections. We can take the videos from our different platforms and organize them together in one beautiful video page. Squarespace also gave us the tools we needed to set up an online store for our Nara brand. Their interface makes it super simple whether you're selling physical, digital, or service products. Head to squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash wongfu to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Now, let's get back to the video. Get into some, like, I guess, spoiler things. Yeah. Okay, okay. And we could talk about the positives. The, okay. You know, things okay, that we okay. liked. Okay, okay, okay. We'll start with some things okay. we liked. Okay, okay. Um, okay, spoilers. Spoilers so ahead. If you didn't finish the series, please leave and finish it, and then you can come back. Yeah, or if you're okay with a little bit of spoilers because, you know, you watch the animation. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's fine, too. That's okay. fine, too. Yeah. All right. All right. I guess um, there's, like, a lot of casting things that I liked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, Daniel Dallas? Day Kim. Daniel oh, Day Kim. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Arden. Arden, Arden was Great really job. good. Great job. Um, I like Dallas a lot. Yeah. Dallas Zuko. did a really good job. I think he did the best out of all the characters, like yeah. emulating his character. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I really yeah. liked Aang, the actor. He's so cute. He's yeah, really Aang was cute. really cute. Yeah, yeah. He's really yeah. Cute. And like his character has so much, uh, there's so much dimension to that and yeah. all of, like weight that he has to carry. Yeah. That yeah. I think it's a challenging role, but mm -hmm. I think he did a good job. Yeah. 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 I think there's there a lot of things he had to try to hit, and I think. Especially considering his age, he, yeah. he did a good job with that. Mm -hmm. And like for me personally, I I think overall, I think I, I'm pretty happy yeah. with the cast. The cast mm -hmm. is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, oh, both Suki and Jets. Dude, oh my god, they, they those, killed it. Yo, man, those, those are like fan favorites right now. Yeah. Yo, Dude, Jet. are you jetting right now? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> not, that's what I meant. I, don't think, I, didn't mean, <laughs> I didn't mean jetting. Like, but you're just doing this head thing, and I'm like, I'm just. just yeah, so you like Jet's Jet's hot. Jet's hot. Jet's, Jet's a good looking person. Hey, Dude. but also very suave. Let's be hundred percent on purpose when they when they had her take the makeup off. Oh then Suki. Like I was Suki, like, like oh so happen. many guys are like Yeah, but you you know they, why they did it. They want yeah, they wanted people to be like, Oh, that's why he's attracted. Yeah, you, you made a good point where it's like we need to recognize her. Yeah, yeah, yeah for, and for I guess later that's on. a smart uh, thing to have. Mm -hmm. I guess in the cartoon it was easier to recognize her because she was the most like detailed yeah. cartoon. Oh, yeah, you have all yeah. the other all, all the Kyoshi yeah, yeah. warriors, yeah, yeah, but yeah. yeah. But there were a lot of changes. Yeah. yeah. I think I was surprised by how much because by the mm -hmm. by the first two episodes I thought, oh, it's like, like yeah. oh, there's a new like first scene where they show. Which is fine. I actually did like this, that part so, with yeah, the the air temple, the air temple, mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. war and stuff. That was fine. That the the the, the, the 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 comet festival, like I actually liked that part. Mm -hmm. It gives more context. Like I was, ta I was like watching it with someone else, and they were like, "Oh, you should have just thrown them in like you did in the cartoon." And yeah. I was like, "I think for the people who don't really know Avatar, mm -hmm. this is a really good beginning like yeah. exposition yeah, yeah. for the world." Yeah, I, I, know, I, I agree. That's good. I like that they had that fight too. I think the only thing I wish they didn't do is reveal that it was destroyed completely. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. like, like we were, we find out when yeah, he finds out. Yeah. yeah. Uh, because I think I think uh, Grand Grand like tells him. Yeah. yeah. And I think that's like. I think in the animation he doesn't discover that until no, later. No, um, that like everything's destroyed. Yeah. No. It's like he yeah. knows that no one's seen an Airbender in a while. Right. It's more like, oh, where are the Airbenders? Yeah. And yeah. Then you get it, and then you find out that they're, yeah. they're all gone. Uh, oh, one other change. Uh, it was. Uh, we, we also talked about this earlier with, um, UA's fiance, uh, like uh, giving him like. Like they they were on like good terms that like they were yeah. broken up and that he was friends with Sokka. I'm like, oh, that actually, for some reason, like, oh, this this felt right. It was funny because I was like, man, this guy is so, like, nice. I was like, <laughs> man, this guy really praises. He's him. really pretty, <laughs> yeah. and I don't know why you like Sokka really. Well, because like in the cartoon, I think the guy like the fiance was kind of just like, yeah, he's supposed like, to be like, like an f boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, did. didn't, yeah, didn't care about Sokka. Yeah, that was interesting. Um... But that was like an interesting change. Yeah, so I appreciated yeah. like there's effort to yeah, kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah. And I think those changes, I was like, oh, I, yeah. I see why you did it. And I, I, I respect the effort. And I, I think yeah. those yeah. worked for me. They also had to like merge a lot of stories. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Which um, 
is unfortunate sometimes, but also understandable for when you're condensing so mm-hmm. much story into eight episodes. So, like, I could get behind, like, episode three of Mashu. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Certain things. Yes. Kind of oh, combining, over, like, Jet. Jet. And... Me- the jet, the Mechanist, Mechanist and oh, yeah. Omashu. There is, those three were good. That was, oh, yeah, I was, Our, I was okay I was with okay. that. Yeah. Combining it with the secret tunnel. That was super random. That. I don't, I don't think they needed yeah. to do yeah, that. Yeah, I think secret tunnel should have stayed its own thing. Yeah. The other three combined, I'm like, I, I understand. And like, it kind of shows, it was a moment where, oh, here's just three different aspects of Earth Kingdom yeah. all at once. I'm like, oh, that's, that's pretty efficient. I, I get why you would do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Man, Secret Tunnel, when they sh- when I showed up, I was like, man, like, are you, that's the first time, like, a book two thing yeah. was, like, coming into yeah. this. I was like, are you using real estate for this season for book two things? Yeah. Well, I was, I just didn't understand because it didn't feel like it added anything. Yeah. It just felt like a waste of time. Like, it I, did feel I, like I, a waste of time. I, I didn't care about it at all. And they didn't really kind of work together because they were, like, kind of paralleling those two yeah. conflicts. Yeah. And they didn't... Oh, my God. There was that part where it was, like, the, the badger, it's love. Yeah. And I was like... <laughs> yeah, yeah there's some Luke and Leia stuff going on. I was like, mm, yeah, incest. Uh, it was a little, they said they wanted to make like Game that. of Thrones. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so Game of Thrones. <laughs> oh, sorry. my god. I'm sorry. But yeah, we're getting into like some come critiques as well. Yeah. Um, um, but yeah, that episode with Boomy, I think, was pretty disappointing. Oh yeah. yeah. We, we, once we talk about critiques, I can talk. About it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Let's open it up. We're gonna open up the Critique. critiques. Too. That's so oh, sad. They changed go. Boomy. I love Boomy. Uh, that was a big disappointment. Yeah. That was my... They made him so bitter and yeah. upset when he's supposed to be like crazy, happy, chaotic, mm-hmm. yeah, neutral type. I, I, I For the first four episodes of Avatar, it was like... I, I, I usually like... When I, like, I'm like really watching a show, I won't do anything else. Uh-huh. After that episode, I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm not going to pay attention to this. <laughs> I started... Yeah. <laughs> I'm so gonna, upset. I need to care less. Yeah. yeah, I, yeah. I, need, I can't care too much about the show anymore. Yeah, because they, they, they changed a lot. Because, yeah, that, that's such a like heartwarming episode, mm-hmm. too. Yeah. The animation, and like the reveal of mm-hmm. who Bumi is yeah. was something they just completely got rid of and they kind of told they told that right off the bat. I, yeah. I, I think um, it, the other thing is they kind of changed like the fundamentals of like a good earthbender because... Yeah. For, for Boomy, the whole reason why he's a good earthbender is part of his philosophy of the wait and listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he doesn't do that at all. He doesn't even mention it at all. Yeah. And that's supposed to be like, oh, that's like the whole stance of like earthbenders mm-hmm. and like what uh, Aang eventually looks for in a teacher and that's how he finds Toph later on. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, oh, you don't have any of that. And now he's kind of just like, also like it's a little confusing. Like, is he even going to be like good later on? Yeah, yeah. And like, um, that, that also goes on to another thing where like, I feel like, Aang is teaching people more things than he's learning yeah. in general. Like Aang's not learning anything. He's just teaching these old yeah. people. Yeah. He's very wise already <laughs> yeah. in this first season. He's like telling Katara, teaching Katara a lot of uh, lessons and yeah. Yeah. Uh, lost speeches. For me, like Katara somehow mastering waterbending by himself herself this series it doesn't make sense because mm-hmm. it feels like she just like she started off weak and then Aang was like oh energy just flow yeah. and then suddenly she can like yeah yeah a water it was ball. a little bit of like ray from star yeah. wars you know? yeah and yeah. it was just everything suddenly became easy suddenly she knows how to like mm-hmm. do ice too mm, yeah. and her fight with zuko was like you know like whatever and i was like you had this doesn't feel deserved mm-hmm. for you to know how to master water bending, and then to imply that yeah. she's gonna be the one to teach Aang, I'm like exactly yeah yeah. I think there's that a, there was a, there was a clear opportunity to allow that uh, the setup that she mm-hmm. can teach mm-hmm. yeah. Aang because of what she learned through the yeah. season yeah. and through Paku. Yeah, like the fight with Paku is her like she she's fighting that she just is, she's supposed to be able to. Uh, be a waterbender like fighter and that's her justification there not that I'm a master as well it's yeah. I'm worth to be taught by you even, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. and uh, they, they changed that I was like yeah. oh uh, I don't know you know what also I liked I like even though I, I kind of wish the Iroh uh, Zuko stuff was in book two more uh-huh. mm. like like so, still hearing the song of like, oh, so yeah. Yeah, like and those like emotional scenes yeah, yeah, yeah I was like sit, that, that whole scene was nice when I was like, like this is kind of nice I think it helps establish why Iroh is so yeah, yeah. yes attached to Zuko mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and it's not even because it's like um, Iroh's reminded of like his own son through Zuko it's like yeah. Zuko actually was a very good nephew yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Despite the propaganda, he still yeah. kind of yeah. kind of sympathized mm-hmm. and kind of um, did something heartfelt. Yeah, yeah. So like, I, like that storyline actually is like probably my the strongest mm-hmm. for me right now. Mm-hmm. Still, 
on the flip side of that, one thing I didn't <laughs> like with Iroh was uh, when he was captured by the Earthbenders. Mm-hmm. Like, how oh my much... god, they made him so like, yeah, yeah, he like, like antagonized war... them. He's like... such a. They made him more like war criminally, like yeah, yeah, like he he doesn't seem like he's he isn't like found that like inner peace like the Iroh in the TV show did. Yeah, like he's a pacifist mm-hmm. now yeah, because kind of a gr- yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and then like. But then the later on when you thought he would like go all out when when Zhang's about to kill the fish, he kind of just stands there. I was like, he's like, oh, if you do anything to the fish, I'll uh, leash upon you uh, like uh, tenfold. tenfold. And then the guy just he just watches him pick up the fish What's and he bag? doesn't do anything. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, it me. Oh, I also didn't. Just standing there. I don't know why they made like the knife thing a thing. Like. That was so ah. unnecessary. The Ooh. knife, the, oh, the, the knife that can st- kill spirits. I'm like, bro. Just kill it. It's the fish. You, <laughs> it's the fish. You, it's fish. In the cartoon, they just use firebending. Like, it's yeah. really not that. Yeah. But like, Iroh like goes all out trying to defend the fish in the TV show, and here it's like, oh, I'm just gonna watch it yeah. until someone else does something. Yeah. I feel like this Iroh is like much more angrier than like. Yeah. You know, he's he's much more of a pacifist like in, in like the show mm-hmm. in the cartoon, but here mm-hmm. he's like. For some reason, more like angrier slash, he doesn't feel like he feels bad that he's killed a bunch of people in the past. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know. Do you think they're... especially that scene? Yeah, yeah. Like, especially that scene. Do you think they're trying to do something with that? Like, I don't know. I, don't know. I think maybe maybe it's just like, yeah. That that scene is probably the one that stood out the most. Yeah. And like at the end of it, he kind of sacrifices him. He doesn't kill him. But like that's but, still like, different than. Yeah. There's so much more we could talk about. Could talk yeah. About there's so a lot. Much. Lot. Lot happened. Yeah. But um. Have you watched Avatar? Let us know. <laughs> How do you feel? Do you agree with anything we said? Also, I, I think it's really cool to see so many people with different kind of opinions mm-hmm. yeah. um, coming out of this show. There's people that love it and still think it's a really great adaptation. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And um, and there's a lot of debate on like kind of what they want to see from mm-hmm. this live action. Mm-hmm. So I'm, I'm sure everyone will have different opinions too. Yeah. But either way... It's cool that we have this to talk about. I know. It's cool that there's opportunities for our friends like Arden and DDK yeah. and more, hopefully, to have roles. And um, yeah, Netflix is doing a lot for Asian content. Yeah. So. You think there's going to be a season two? I hope so. I hope so, too. I hope so. And I, I, I don't know. They don't release numbers and stuff, but I'm pretty sure the viewership was good. I think there was... <laughs> it was like number like, one, right? So many people one. in my stories, I feel like, have watched this or yeah. given opinions. I'm like, there's. it's probably like doing really well. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So um, yeah, let's let's cross our fingers. I hope. Mm-hmm. Hopefully, they listen to the fans mm-hmm. and yeah. kind of make some corrections and course correct. Um, but until then, see you in the next break room. Yes, we'll talk about more things we're watching. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye.